Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Um, let me start off by saying that um, pretty much the only time you ever have to take your blade off your, off your lawnmower is if you have damage to the blade and you're going to perhaps change it or perhaps you're taking your blade off to, to sharpen it. Um, but I must stress that you must never start your machine when the blade is off. And I'm going to do a video. I've actually been putting it off for a long time because I know it's probably going to hurt me. But I'm going to start the machine with the blade and then I'm going to take the blade off and start it again and you can see what happens. So you can see I've taken the blade off. And that's what it looks like underneath, no blade. So you know what to look for. That starter rope is probably going to get pulled right out of my hand. So to understand why this is happening, you have to look at the uh, formula for momentum. And that is P equals MV, where MV is mass times velocity. If you can imagine a 20 kilogram old child, a 20 kilogram weight child on a bicycle going down a hill, you should be able to stop them if they're going at, say, 10 kilometers an hour. But if you put a 200 kilogram guy on that same bicycle and he goes down the hill at the same speed, it's very likely that you are not going to stop him because the mass is much more. So the momentum is much more. So let me try and explain very briefly how a lawnmower works. When you pull your starter rope, it turns the flywheel and that is connected all the way down it's connected to your blades at the bottom so as you pull this it turns the flywheel and it's also turning the blades and at the same time it's causing the crankshaft to also turn around and that forces the piston upwards so now I'm going to ask you to use your imagination you have a flywheel and you have a blade at the bottom of the machine when you pull the starter rope the, um, the flywheel turns and the blade also turns and because the blade has weight or mass um, it has a certain amount of um, momentum mass times velocity however if you take the blade off and you pull the starter rope there is no momentum to keep the flywheel going in a certain direction, which is a clockwise direction. So at the point of ignition, top dead center, when the spark plug fires, instead of carrying on clockwise, the flywheel can actually reverse because there is no momentum to keep it going in a clockwise direction. And if the, fly, if the flywheel suddenly reverses in direction, it will pull that starter rope right out of your hand, which is actually what happened. And um, anyway, I have a friend, uh, John, who lives in America, uh, who, helped me, who helped me make this video. So cheers, John. Thanks a lot.